Hey there! Welcome to Life Noggin. In a world of superhero movies and shirtless scenes in our favorite TV shows, it might want to make people lose weight really quickly. It had me wondering, what happens if you lose a bunch of weight super fast? First off, how exactly does someone lose weight? Well, it can be somewhat complicated and the process can vary person to person. However, in general, it usually comes down to eating less calories and or burning more calories through things like exercise. It's about having your body use more calories than you are taking in. A pound is about 3,500 calories, so you need to cut down or burn that much in order for the the scale to start counting down. In general, it's usually advised to try for slow and steady weight loss at about a pound or two a week, meaning about 500 to 1,000 calories a day. And if it's fat you just burned off, a recent study found that you actually exhale most of it as carbon dioxide. Even losing a little bit of weight can have some cool effects. The Center for Disease Control reported that even a modest weight loss at around 5 to 10 percent of your body weight is likely to have health effects such as improvements in blood pressure, blood cholesterol, and blood sugar. Oh, I said blood three times, so this guy's trying to get a hold of me. But what if you lose weight super fast? Apart from it often being seen as unhealthy or an unsustainable way of losing weight, Rapid weight loss can have some side effects that you probably don't want. When talking about losing weight, people generally mean they want to specifically lose fat. This is easier to do with slower and steadier weight loss, but rapid weight loss is more likely to cause you to lose water weight or even lean tissue like muscle. Also, this type of quick weight loss can increase your risk of developing gallstones. Gallstones are hard crystals that may form in the gallbladder and can be as little as a pebble or as big as a golf ball. Wow, that does not sound pleasant. They are typically made of cholesterol and form when substances in your bile join together. While you can have them and not have any symptoms, they can sometimes lead to some pretty uncool things like pain and nausea in the abdomen. In some cases, serious health problems can arise to the point where the gallbladder needs to be removed. Further problems can also arise, especially if you're restricting your calories during this time. Things like fatigue, nausea, and constipation can occur. These are usually not as serious and can improve in a few weeks. But if you're on a diet of fewer than 800 calories, the U.S. Department of Health and Services reported that it can lead to some serious heart problems. Losing weight can be cool and a noble goal. Just make sure you're doing it for the right reasons and in a healthy way. You want to lose weight at a rate that is best and healthy for you. Remember to consult a doctor before you try anything. And also remember, you don't need to be a certain weight to be any more or less special. We're all about positivity here. And if you enjoyed this video, you're definitely going to want to check out our video we did on what would happen if you never stopped eating. One recent study found a significant relationship between added sugar consumption and an increased risk of dying from cardiovascular disease when observing participants for over 14 years. As always, my name is Blocko. This has been Life Noggin. Don't forget to keep on thinking.